Hello, this is Arcades, and welcome to another Stormworks Build and Rescue episode. This time it's going to be a little bit of spotlight. I've uh, been doing a few of the oil rig builds, so I figured I'd do a little bit of spotlight today. And uh, I thought I'd uh, show something interesting I found in the workshop. It's a microtroller that has a rather interesting feature. And so far it seems to be working well enough. So, right down here, this picture. <laughs> First, let me uh, get you the name. It is the LiDAR camera work in process. And uh, yeah, that, that's it. There's two screenshots. And uh, for the thing, looks amazing. But as you can see right here, I have it set up. And it is uh, highlighting something. The question is... Can you figure out what? I'm sitting uh, about a few hundred meters from it. And uh, yeah, so let me show you what it is. And then we're going to see if we can get a better picture of it by getting in a little closer. Because we are, well, <laughs> the glitch ruined the fun. <laughs> but yeah, I've got the brick of the HMS Britannic, HMS HS Britannic here. And we're going to be using this little uh, camera tool and we're gonna scan over it whoops and I've got it on my uh, I installed it on my ship uh, hunter here uh, which is on the workshop if you look at my workshop uh, anyways yes self-promotion I know not I, I, I don't consider my that shameless anyways so as you can see we have a little bit of hollow I'm pretty sure that is it we're gonna move forward a bit and uh, check it out. Don't mind the jet engines, this will probably be a little loud. I'm gonna reduce the speed or the, the throttle because I wanna creep up on it and get another picture. Okay. So we're about 270 from there and I'm gonna pull forward probably about another uh, 20 to 30. And then take another picture, so to speak. Because it does just kind of, from what I can tell, experimenting with it, it just takes a picture. Alright, you know what? Here's a good spot. Now, I when I got downloaded in the workshop, it had the the uh, sensor placed forward, so that's how I oriented it. I'm thinking of coming back a little later. And so, when you get installed, if you want to use it, you just hit small, medium, large, it looks like, for the size of the pictures, and apparently you can zoom in, zoom out. Alright, let me kill the engine. Quieten it up a little bit so you can hear me better. And as you can see, it's slowly making out the scan. Now this is this seems to be normal, where it'll just blank out like that so far. And as you can see, it's now just drawing out the picture. It takes a little bit, especially in these large ones like I did. It probably doesn't help that I'm also right next to the wreck, which prop, which has a lot of physics going on. <laughs> and it really is like it's just taking a picture. Okay, now we're getting kind of downwards, and I wonder if my angle's a little too sharp for it to see the wreck. Yeah, we went up a lot farther than I was expecting to go. But as you can see, it's bringing up a... Uh...
Yeah, I think I might be just a little too... No, it might actually be getting it. Yeah, it might be getting it. Yeah, right there. I think that's the wreck right there, and that's the rock on the back side of it. Obviously, it's not very, you know... Because it... Yeah, yeah, you can see there's like a set of rocks in the back side. So I'm pretty sure uh, most of this is like the air in my boat, so... Wait, I just zoomed in. Ah, it's got to do it all over again. <laughs> yeah, okay, okay. So, seems if you want to... get a different picture you gotta gotta redo the picture each and every time but now the creator on this thing said it was a work in progress this wasn't a fully developed module yet but it was like a proof of concept and yeah this is uh i think it broke it <laughs> Uh, I think I broke it. Oh, it's graphing out the, uh, the shape of my hull. <laughs> Yeah, it's graphing out the shape of the hull of the ship. Okay, here we go. Now we're getting actual... Uh... Yeah, Okay, yeah, so, yeah, I think that's still the hole there. I think it's just, uh, whoops, was well, just base. oh, no, is it still going? Yeah, it's probably getting the bottom half there. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to come back here, I want to reinstall it vertically, and see how it looks on the picture, so give me a moment, I'll get back out here, and we're going to take a look at it with the alternate configuration. Okay, so we're back here in the workshop. Um, yeah, so if you want to install this, uh, I figured I'd go over this since I'm going to have to do this, just this thing anyways. So you want to you want to bring it in via your selection grid. And it'll be under your workshop right here. Now when it comes in, it comes in as this little package. And it had the camera pointed straight forward, so that's why I have it oriented as I do. I'm going to go ahead and... The only thing you really need to worry about is the microcontroller, I guess the sensor too, unless you have something else. Just make sure it's oriented, I guess, the right way. And they have the monitor here. But the only thing that's really needed is, I guess, the monitor and the microcontroller and the sensor. All this is just to get the example running. And actually, all I'm going to do is, uh, I already technically had, well, no. This sensor is for another piece of equipment on my uh, boat, so we're just going to create a... Uh, is that actually for anything in particular? Actually, it looks like no. So... Hang on. Okay, so we're going to knock out these blocks right here. Ah, 
I am going to just leave it in that orientation. I'm just rotating it. So I'm going to place it there. And yeah, so you just install the sensor. I had it facing forward, now I have it facing down. And I just put the microcontroller up here with all my other logic crap on this ship. <laughs> I actually think it looks, yeah, anyways, I digress. And I got this screen right here. I'm gonna leave that be for now, and uh, yeah. It's pretty much that simple. Just incorporate the power logic. Everything should be already hooked up, and uh, away you should go. So give me a moment. I'm gonna get back out to the thing, and uh, yeah. We're going to check out the new picture. Okay, I am back out at the, at the site of uh, the rec site for the Britannic. As you can see right there. So let's take a look at this and let's see, uh, let's see how this looks on the picture. So let's just give it a minute to do its job. Because now I got it pointing straight and down, so it's going to be doing underneath. And uh, let's see how it deals with the orientation. Because the ship is sideways underneath me, per or perpendicular to my shape, so. Okay, I think that's, I, I was just going to let it go graph, but I think that's enough that we can actually tell the shape, because there's the brow, right there in the center is the uh, broken bow, and there's the rest of the body of the ship. And I think, I can't tell because there's kind of a glare from the lights. I kind of have to sit to keep the monitor on, but... Yeah, is there's uh So we got this picture I think my yeah, I think it's backwards. So yeah, make sure when you insert it you get something, but otherwise, yeah, it's uh <laughs> That's pretty nice. Uh, <laughs> the camera's in backwards. <laughs> it got inverted somehow. But as you can see, definitely managed to get the uh, Titanic or Britannic in there. And uh, that's a pretty solid picture. I mean, other than I think I installed the uh, camera invertedly. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, this is the. Uh, LiDAR camera, work in progress, it is by Quentin, I'll say, Quentin, yes, we will go by Quentin, and uh, I don't know if I'll be using it more, but it's definitely a cool novelty item, at least, and it seems to be a good solid work in progress, uh, work, uh, proof of concept, <laughs> so, yeah, I would suggest trying to uh, give it a try out, install it on your own thing, see how it goes. So yeah, this is Arcades. Hope you had a good time. Hope you enjoyed what you watched. If you do, like, subscribe, all that fun junk, and uh, yeah, leave a comment. Tell me what you think about it. Yeah, this is Arcades, signing out. Have yourself a good day.